Okay, so hi everybody. Um, <clears throat> I hope this video finds you well. We're going to just kind of talk about the Model 24 for a minute. And we're going to talk about um, the routing issue first with how to, you know, instead of using channels 1 and 2, which I told you about before, we want them to get them over here to hear Reaper or the, the DAW coming back through the PC mode, which is switched on up here. So my PC is switched on. And then these two tracks can be switched to live now because they're just in inputs now, which is what we want. So the next thing, so then you go over to the DAW. Um, and you uh, have to make sure that this routing for the master says 21 and 22. So you got to create a new one and assign it to 21 and 22. I already have that. Originally I had... One and two, like I said, that's how it starts out. So we don't want that. I mean, we can keep it on there and just mute it if we don't want it. Switch back and forth. Of course, you would have to have these things switched to PC. Um, but we don't want to do that. So Let's just delete the one that says one and two. We'll keep that one. So that's going to 21 and 22, which is this right here. All right. So we're coming up back in out of there. That's cool. In a nutshell, that's how it works. What's happening is in my ears, in my headphones, because that's how I hear it, because this main sends it to the control room knob. So if I turn that volume goes up and down for me, it doesn't for you though, because you're hearing it through the sub, this fader now, which is my stereo mix from uh, Reaper is coming <clears throat> being routed through the sub over to this and so it's being pushed out of here see um out of my sub output up there like i said into the other mixer this little uh alesis four channel mixer usb and that's going into my um reaper or no that's that's going into obs that other little mixer over there. So that's how I'm doing that. I know there's a lot of other ways to do it. We're just spending some time here with this board. When I got this thing, I mean, I don't know, and I don't, I'm new to the DAWs like so many of us are. And so I just wanted to figure out how to get this thing 16 channels in over the uh, USB separate channels yeah. into. OBS or Reaper. Yo. Really? Y'all come on in. I'm just gonna finish this video. But you can chill. So anyway. So what we have now is a Reaper going into this and now these two channels can be used as inputs. And then the other thing I found that was cool is that you can... You want to throw on a set of headphones? Yeah, you can throw on that set of headphones and you can hear everything I'm hearing. Oh, shit. Yeah, throw on a set of headphones. Tell me when you can hear about like that. Uh -huh. Cool. All right. 
So the other thing that's cool that I figured out about this machine is that you guys are all hearing the Reaper through here. But I figured out how to sum this thing over to this this without using this Bluetooth channel with the RCA left and right. <clears throat> you can actually go out of the back of the, the DP32SD. There's on the back of there, back here, there are monitor out, monitor out right and left. So I just took some guitar cables and went out of there. I should now I'm going to buy some better regular whatever patch cables for that. But I used audio or guitar cables to go over into track 17 and 18. And that is switched to live up there. And it's panned to the center. And the the three band EQ doesn't do anything because it's going into a uh, Reaper. Wow. Actually, yeah, because it's pre-fader. Not only pre-fader, but it's pre-EQ. So the only thing, so whatever. So basically I'm summing this to a stereo left and right through 17 and 18. So I can get my mix into there, right? So if I start with my mix, let's see how it sounds. So again, this board is going into this channel right here. I know this channel, 17, 18, it's switched to live. So watch, I'll hit play. Let me get my kick, snare, and yeah, my kick and snare going. I have kick and then I have over and under snare. So I'll hit play. Here it is. So you can hear that. So it's great because it's being summed over. So let's fill in the rest of the kit. Now here's some bass. We'll just... Actually, wait, let's go back a little bit. We'll just do the voice also. Sorry about that, from the beginning. Keyboard.
All right, so that's the um, summing of the DP30 Tascam DP32SD over to the Model 24, the Tascam Model 24. Um, I hope you enjoy this video. And uh, there's no need to buy one or the other of these machines. I think in time, we get both of them. They're a lot of fun. And uh, have a great night.